Hey everybody, Yogi here, Galveston, Texas, on a breezy but beautifully warm evening. Today, we are going... It's beautiful! We're going over there. We're going to check out the Pleasure Pier of Galveston, Texas. So come along, let's do that, all right? Sound good? Let's do it. Road Trips with Yogi starts now. The chair swing ride is not working tonight. And there is actually quite a line to get in. You have to pay, I believe it's like $10 per person to just go on the pier. And then your rides and games will be extra. I'm probably not gonna go on any rides tonight. Depending on what time we get in there, who knows. So, I guess we keep waiting. and shrimp go together like peas and carrots how do you like your shrimp comment below First things you see when you walk on the Pleasure Pier is not only the carousel but the kiddie ride section. So we got that right there. Got a little Ferris wheel over here and a little car ride right here. You get some face painting, airbrush, the bumper cars. Oh, there you go. You got the kiddie bumper cars over there. Oh, the teacup ride. There you go. Check out the teacup ride, shall we? Then we have the adult bumper cars. Again, I'm not riding any of these rides. We just got a pass to walk the pier. What do you think of Pleasure Pier so far, Chucky? Cool. It is cool. See the price on that food? Oof. I don't think that's that bad. This is cool. Rock and roll. There it is. They ain't rocking yet and they ain't rolling yet. I love rides like these. The big loop-de-loop -loop is off. It's not working tonight. Oh, there is a water ride here. There you go. Let's see who comes down. Oh, there you go. Came down there. Oh, well, the loop to loop is working. I thought it was off. There it is. Whoa! Oh, <laughs> Whoops! I gotta wait for the next people to come down. I'm waiting for the next boat to come down. I just want to see how how wet they get. We get this place pretty wet here. Up there go some people up there. They used to have a Yankee Clipper ride and a log ride at Great America. Oh, I hear people coming down. There they come. They're around in the corner. There they come. Oh yeah, they got one. <laughs> I'm dry. No wetness here. Look, they got a, some plexiglass up, so yeah, the soak zone. I'd have to say that's one ride you will not get me on. 
That ride is, I don't know. Maybe I'm just too old for it. I don't know, does that thing actually go all the way around? I think it does. Uh, I'm getting sick watching that. Holy crap. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> And here's another ride. I don't know what this ride does. It's kinda, I guess it swings you sideways, huh? What's it called? The Sky Shooter. Let's see what this ride does. Yeah, I can handle that so far. It's not too bad. It's going to start doing something really crazy now, watch. Ah, up and down. Well, Chucky, tomorrow we start heading north. <laughs> Chucky says boo. Oh, almost nailed it. And here you got your games that you have no chance of winning. Iron Shark Attack, Tub Toss. And of course, you got to have the arcade. I guess I just don't have the courage I used to. I'm an old man now. So I can't really, <laughs> I can't really fathom something like that or stomach it. Huh. That long. I don't care. Yes, I am a wuss when it comes to certain rides. I'll be the first to admit it. I can go on roller coasters. I have no problem with that. Ooh, how about this beautiful view of Galveston from the water? Let's take a look. That's how beautiful, huh? It's being a really cool pier. Checking out the beautiful city of Galveston. I'm glad we decided to make this a stop on our trip because uh, it's worth it. I would come down here again. There's a beautiful moon. Okay, I finished what had to be the worst sandwich I possibly have had so I paid $6.25 for a pulled pork sandwich I know don't expect much from a fair or a pier but $6.25 for the amount of sandwich there was is shameful in my opinion that bun could have been twice the size I mean that thing was about the size of a dinner roll and a half maybe that's how big that bun was not very big like I said it was probably a Walmart bun and the barbecue um, it just fail big time fail um, I do not suggest you get this barbecue sandwich here I suggest you get anything but the sandwich get a pretzel get a hot dog that's interesting, the platform that that's on. That's... Roller coaster still is not operating either. Here's a better shot of the other side of the pier. That is Galveston. It's too bad we only spent one night here. Well, one full day. Oh, the roller coaster is going. Oh, well, let's go over there and check it out. There's a Texas Flyer, which is not operating right now. Look at that, look at that slope. That's like straight down for a second there. It's like a zipper. And you do all sorts of loops, curves. Fortunately, they're blasting music all over the place, so I'm gonna have to do some heavy editing now. Don't walk by, give it a try. That's kinda cool. The old tiny poster. They have the big wheel lit up. I don't think it's working right now. Ugh. Didn't it just be dangling there? <laughs> oh, thanks. Yes, you can comment what a chicken I am down below. I don't care. You can call me. Well, I'll keep it clean, but I ain't going on that. There's the Galaxy Wheel, which is not operational right now. We were waiting in line, I guess, the Paul went out and cut off most of the rides. And I apologize for the wind, because it's probably going to be pretty windy. Look at that, they have a stage. 
We actually have concerts here, huh? It's kind of cool to have a stage with a big wheel in back there. And we're at the end of the pier. No entry or jumping, why would you? It's a far drop and it's probably pretty damn deep right here. I don't know if you can see the boats in the distance. Look at that. We go straight up. See them? <laughs> and you get to the top and it's a real short one there. Down, curly Q. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, I can't help it. One more view. It's really windy, so I apologize for the wind noise if there is any. Listen to those beautiful waves. It's coming in on the shore. You know, I would have loved to have sat on the beach. There's still people here sitting on the beach. I would have loved to have sat on the beach and maybe gone in the water, but the water was real dirty looking, real sandy. But out there are all the ships again. I know, show me something else, Yogi. Oh, one more look at the pier. On this side. Now this is running. This wasn't running when I when we were standing in line, but it is now. The kitty swing. And there's two kids on it. So my thoughts about Pleasure Pier. It costs ten dollars to just go on the pier if you're just going to walk the pier. You do have the option of going on rides once you're inside. Uh, pretty cheap actually it's only like $26.99 I think for adults and I think a little bit cheaper for an all-day pass and there's like 16 rides there so you can go on all the rides all day long for like you know 26 bucks a person so that's it's pretty cheap again there's not a ton of rides there but pretty cheap pretty cheap um, food and drinks gonna cost you Avoid the barbecue pork sandwich again. Nowhere wor near worth uh, six twenty-five. I think it was. I wouldn't have paid a dollar for that thing if, if I knew it was going to be what it was. I would not have bought that sandwich, and I hope I don't regret it later. Um, I'd like to thank you all for joining me on this road trip. Um, please like, share, subscribe and click on that notification bell you get informed when new episodes are uploaded uh, you can also check out www.patreon.com forward slash road trips with yogi and if you feel so inclined to do so and you like my channel and you like the content i provide please consider making a donation and helping support my channel so i can do other road trips like this and bring you other things another thing i just hit the 200 subscriber mark may not sound like much but I only started this last year. I have not been pushing my channel, so to speak. I've just been letting it grow organically, letting people find it and watching it. And I appreciate all 200 and I think one of you right now. So thank you all for subscribing to my channel. I hope to bring you the best content I can and keep you watching. So from Pleasure Pier in Gulf, not Gulfport, that was the last trip, um, Galveston, Texas. This pretty much ends our Texas part. We start heading back north tomorrow morning. So we'll be filming from the road the next couple days so we get back up to Wisconsin. Um, thank you all for watching. And until the next one, I'm Yogi. And I'm out of here. You get all sorts of cars on this road, I'll tell you. Decked out, tricked out, and some loud cars too. So Chuck. Yes. Tonight's our last night in Galveston. We only stayed for a day and a half. Ah, 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 ah. What are your thoughts of Galveston? I like Galveston. I think it's pretty cool. All right, that's all you got, huh? Well, yeah, it's pretty amazing. It's right on the coast and there's all kinds of stuff to do. True. What was your favorite part about Galveston? Did you have one? I liked the pier. I liked the cruise ships. There you go. And I liked the ocean, the Gulf. Would you come back? Absolutely. All righty. Here's some lovely palm trees that have kind of sort of survived, but 
that much as we walk through the valley of the shadow of palm trees. I will fear no Galveston.